Hi guys, let's start the briefing for this stage. The main thing to grasp today is that the route is flat and without any difficulties. But be on your guard as the wind can lead to Bordeaux. As we've got the leader's jersey, we'll have to shoulder our responsibilities and set the pace in the peloton. But the main opponent today is the wind. Normally, we'd put a cross through this stage. But with the wind, the outcome is unclear. It's up to us to seize the opportunity for a good result. Have a good stage. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Denmark. There's a good chance that the hierarchy established after the inaugural time trial will be shattered by the end of this first road race stage. The presence of wind during the crossing of the Great Belt Bridge could split the peloton into numerous echelons. And as is often the case, some riders could already lose a lot of time in the general classification. He is a pure ruler who relies on his power to tip the scales. Anyway, he doesn't have much choice given his qualities as a sprinter. Guys, today it's as flat as a pancake, but there are risks. The final 20 kilometers are on a bridge, so there'll be wind and borders. Good luck. One minute for the breakaway. It's looking good. His best chance of victory is to try a breakaway from far out. One and a half minutes for the breakaway. It might just work. The time gap with the head of the race is stable. The men at the front are approaching an important juncture because they'll soon be contesting the three king of the mountains climbs of the day. Each one will contribute a point toward the polka dot jersey. That might sound anecdotal, but wearing the polka dot jersey in the first week of the Tour de France is an objective that is much sought after by the baroudeurs. Here's the final classified climb of the stage. Once again, there is one point up for grabs in the best climber classification. The breakaway is losing ground.
The men at the front will soon be crossing through the feed zone. Time for them to pick up something to eat that will see them through the second half of the stage. Let's not forget that each intermediate sprint earns points for the first 15 across the line. The first rider scores 20 points. The breakaway is losing ground. is decreasing guys. The peloton should be there for the stage win. The riders up front still have something left. They're upping the pace to try to hold out till the end. The head of the race is one and a half minutes lead on the peloton. Last time check with the breakaway. One minute. Looks like the breakaway still has some gas left. It's still able to widen the gap. Come on, guys. From now on, there's no shelter all the way to the line. You've got to hang in there. Go! Go! I'll make a big effort on the relay. Fifteen kilometers from finish for the man in the front. I'll go full out on the relay. Thirty seconds lead for the head of the race. I'll make a big effort on the relay. Okay. 
Okay, we'll relay flat out. The riders are all back together. Everything will be played out in the final kilometers. Go pull out on the relay. Okay, we'll consume a feed. There are only 10 kilometers left to go, and no one has managed to get away for the stage win. Make a big effort on the relay. Okay, we'll relay hard. Flat out. Just five more kilometers. win to secure the green jersey. Okay, we'll relay hard. Okay, I'll consume a feed. Put in a big acceleration. Three kilometers. Nobody has yet managed to gain the upper hand. I'll go full out on the relay. Last kilometer, it will be decided in a sprint. Okay, I'll put in a big acceleration.
Ladies and gentlemen, applaud him loudly. Here is the winner of the Ruskillen New Ball Stage. Caleb Ewan. Congratulations to him. He managed to maneuver perfectly to snatch this victory. He can savor this moment. He tops the standings and will receive the traditional honors. Here's the yellow jersey of this Tour de France. Philip Campeon! Let's hope for his sake that things go as well in the future. But for now, he can relish the moment. He will climb onto the podium to receive his jersey and a kiss from the hostesses. Here's the green jersey of this Tour de France. Caleb Ewan. Let's hope for his sake that things go as well in the future. But for now, he can relish the moment. We can say that everything is going well for him at the moment. Here's the polka dot jersey of this Tour de France. It's a moment that he should not forget and which marks his career. Come on, let's applaud him once more. We can say that everything is going well for him at the moment. Here's the white jersey of this Tour de France. It's a moment that he should not forget and which marks his career. We had no real ambitions for the classification of this stage. The least that can be said is, you didn't prove me wrong. We retain the yellow jersey. It's today's source of comfort.